Good morning, and welcome to our continuing series on homeopathy with Dr. Pachakalkar. Namaste, sir. We are beginning a new format with uh, briefer answers on specific topics. And this will help people. Uh, you can send all of your questions to me, Narada, N-A-R-A-D-A, -A -A, 12 at gmail.com. And we will consider them for future talks. Uh, today, an interesting topic to begin with because so many people, I'm not able to take spicy, pungent food, but so many people tell me that I'm missing out on so much because the spicy food helps the digestion, it's, it's good for the system, and they have a dozen reasons why I should be taking, but I can't take. Why should we avoid taking spicy food? See, there are advantages of eating spicy. If person likes spicy taste, his salivation will be easier. So, with the food which is tasty for the person, the salivation goes on easily there and that helps in digestion. But barring this, there are some disadvantages. What happens when especially the people who are in sedentary habit, they need to consume more cellulose containing vegetables. Now, if vegetable is too spicy, the, the quantity to be consumed by the person will be small because of this pungentness or too much spicy taste or hot taste the person will not consume adequate quantity of vegetables mm. so indirectly so what we advise is if you are fond of spicy taste you have a side dish in small quantity you can have it along with your main food ah. but don't mix with vegetables best would be like you take boiled vegetables with little bit of salt for taste if needed and then as a side dish you have something spicy if you like it in some people if you eat spicy food for the tongue it is fine to have good taste but it goes on irritating the whole intestinal mucosa and we have seen people where if they, they are not used to it and if they eat spicy food, they get burning in the rectum also. So much so that sometimes we used to feel the person has a proctitis because of some vitamin deficiency or what. Mm. But mainly it was caused because of capsicum, very hot spicy uh, capsicum uh. being consumed. And the moment we stopped that, the person stopped getting irritation in the rectum. So, it has advantages like the green chilies, a rich source of vitamin C also, plus it helps in digestion. But at the same time, the quantity of vegetable consumed is reduced because of that. That should not happen. What about uh, herbs, coriander, basil? Oregano. Yes, yes. They, they are tasty, but somehow they don't irritate your stomach. No, they don't. They don't irritate. No. So, so that moderate or mild type of spice is fine. Ah, okay. It's only when it is too pungent, um, capsicum, the Indian variety, we have some variety, you just put a little bit of it in on the tongue and it starts burning and for minutes together. Even ginger. Many times, like it's mm. quite uh, spicy. But otherwise, coriander and all, they are very mild spicy. Very mild. Yeah. 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 That, okay. that should be fine. Thank you so much.